eternity later. Run. According to the survey, the average daily American commits totals approximately 45 minutes. That's about 152 hours, or 19 full work days a year, driving to work in their cars. In cities like LA and New York City, commuters spend an average of 119 hours a year stuck in traffic. It sounds really horrible to most of the people. Do you feel exhausted from rushing to school every morning, waiting elevator, waiting the traffic light, bus doesn't show up on time, or it just doesn't stop? Sometimes life sucks. But teleportation can definitely help you out. You don't need to wake up two hours earlier just to skip the traffic. You can enjoy your morning coffee and a French toast to start your wonderful day. No sweating, no rushing. Besides saving you plenty of time, teleportation will also make huge changes on our communities and civilizations. Thanks God! Finally, it's the corner of the year, and you're planning on a vacation to enjoy the rest of your year. Wait... Is it... 6,000? You gotta be kidding me! No worries. Now you can teleport to- now you can teleport to anywhere, anytime. No more transportation. You don't need to spend hours and hours on planes. Wow, what an amazing thing. No more transportation means no more transport accident. Yay, you just saved a hundred bucks from your car insurance. No more transportation also means we don't need bridge, crossroad, parking lot, and there will be more rooms for housing, schools, and cheese. Many, many cheese. Everything sounds good, but of course it can't be that simple. At this point, teleportation is about the stage of theory. There are uncountable challenges that scientists need to deal with in the future. But don't give up, scientists from all over the world, they are trying to get there and I believe we will be there soon. Let's brainstorm together, what if teleportation became a reality? Well, first of all, I probably will not walk again. I mean, why should I? <laughs> if we don't walk anymore, what would happen to our body? Perhaps in the future, I will get a chance to do another big question about what would happen if humans don't walk anymore. <laughs> <laughs>